Tim from Your Sex Tech. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to update the system software on your PlayStation 5 through this troubleshooting or safe mode menu so you can apply a fresh new copy of the update. So you can't do this in the PlayStation settings, you have to go to the safe mode menu, otherwise it'll just say it's up to date. So if there's an error, let's press the play station button and go on over to power. Then go to turn off. When we want to completely turn this off, we don't want to enter the rest mode. Otherwise, we won't be able to access the safe mode menu. Now let's scroll on down to my PlayStation 5. And then we need to plug it in using a USB cable. And then, once the PlayStation 5 is completely turned off, we want to hold down the PlayStation button right here. And we will hear one beep. And then we will hear another beep. And then we can go ahead and let go. So once we hear the second beep, let go. Plug in your controller with a USB device. And then press the PlayStation button and you should be able to operate the safe mode menu now. So let's scroll up now, and you can see all the different options. We want to go down to option number four, update system software, select this. Then you have the option to update using the USB drive or update using the internet. Now let's go to update using the internet. It says please wait. And then you're going to have to download the update from the internet, and then it will apply a fresh new copy. So it says it's up to date but we still have the option to update it. So you just come in this section and if there ever was an error with your uh, system software you should be able to resolve it or fix it. So hopefully this quick little video did indeed help you guys out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe my channel down below for more tech videos coming up next on your 6 tech.